and walk around the compound. We'll see some tigers. Oh my gosh, we are here at a at a very at a rare and important moment. There we go, nice. Uh, we have got uh, one of our awesome and intrepid uh, interns, Alex. She is uh, feeding the lemurs. What are they? Uh, what are they getting? This is today. They got pepper, green beans, banana, mango, squash, and strawberries. Nice fruits and veggies. Fruits and veggies. That's wonderful. And you can see how she's kind of tossing them all around, all hither and thither, because uh, lemurs are foraging animals. So they want to be able to have stuff that uh, they can kind of go around and and uh, sniff out and look for and stuff like that. That's a, that's a big part of the enrichment. So, yeah. Uh, Alex here is from Colorado. And uh, she went uh, to UW-Madison. Oh my gosh. So, uh, hey, a uh, Go Badgers, a Wisconsin alum. That's great. That's great. You got any of those like Instagram things that you should be like, yeah, follow me here or anything? Or do you keep yourself private? Yeah, it's private. Okay, well then just never mind. Yeah. There we go. There we go. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. There we go. Hello, all you big cat lovers out there. It's me, Derek, again. Welcome to another super duper fantastic episode of the Walker on the Compound webcast. Hi, how are you? We have uh, part of the care policy. For the weekends and this is like during public time part of care policy during public hours is that uh, people who are staff volunteers interns employees part of the uh, care operations elements of the organization they need to wear uh, or we try to try to have people wear care shirts it's one of those kind of things where it's like i don't my care shirt got you know like eaten by robots and that, that could be like well that's a valid excuse so you know if you show up in a tuxedo we're not going to be like you get your fancy took us out of here no it's just we want to try to have you know everyone kind of wearing the brand and it was a weekend and we had a bunch of horses that we had to butcher four 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 horses and i have care shirts here i i Divide my time between uh, here and my apartment out of state. So I, I, I carry clothes back and forth. And I keep most of my work stuff here. But I think that either stuff was dirty or... No, actually, I'm kind of rambling unnecessarily. Oh, let's just sit on lackey for a little bit. No, I have care shirts, but they're, but they're, they're black. And going out and working out in the sun... Wearing dark clothing, you know, can sometimes not be really all that fun. So I could say, what to do, what to do? I don't have, I don't have a, like a lily white care shirt. Sure, I could just go into the gift shop and grab one, but I like to, uh, you know, I like to problem solve. I like to troubleshoot. So I found a lighter color t-shirt. And a Sharpie. <laughs> a lighter colored t-shirt and a Sharpie. And I put, I put there. So you can see, little thing. It says tigers and stuff. It's tigers and stuff. And then I'm gonna try something. Let's see if I can get this set up to where you'll actually be able to see what it is that I'm talking about. But then I got, I got, I wrote that on the back. This is a care shirt. Care Rescue Texas. CareRescueTexas.com. So, yeah. That. Yeah, so. Not breaking policy. <laughs> yeah, I'm a company man. <laughs> the funny thing is, it took me five minutes. It took me five minutes to make this. I started wearing it around, 
and like Jamie and interns and Heidi are just like, that's amazing. I want one. <laughs> I want one. I'd, is it weird that I want to wear that? <laughs> <laughs> so then Jamie started taking pictures. Jamie started taking pictures of like the actual of the graphics specifically so that uh we can maybe get them made into like PNG files or vectors and then possibly put them <laughs> onto shirts that people can then uh, make donations for. <laughs> Oh, I just saw Sydney and Rasa. Oh, there's there's a tiger butt. There's a tiger butt. Hold on. There's Drew. There's Drew. There's Drew. We're we're webcasting now. We're not live streaming. We're webcasting, so that's what we're doing. Drew is Drew. I started doing that. I uh, I was uh, I was doing a live stream for some of the uh, some of my Patreon supporters. A little thank you very much for, you know, supporting the channel, supporting the content. Really appreciate it. Let's let's have a uh, let's have a live stream together. And it was fun. And it was fun. There was silliness afoot. But Drew, and he's one of our more recent volunteers, and. Really amazing photographer, fantastic photographer, and he spends his uh, spends a lot of weekends out here. He lives over in Tyler, which is about three hours away, so he'll spend his weekends here. And he goes out and he takes amazing pictures. And he posts them on his Instagram, which is Drew some Drew some some, some some. Either way, follow him. Someone who follows him already, can you please just go down to the comment section? <laughs> Right, whatever his Instagram profile is, and just I'm telling you right now, go follow him. They're amazing, amazing pictures, amazing. He's got the eye. He's a shutter bug. Oh, here's two of our other interns. Oh my gosh, we already talked to you, Alex. We don't need to talk to you again. Oh my gosh. Where did they? they, they, they I'm just I'm following them around. Follow it. There we go. There's a Sydney, which actually is coincidentally the name of one of our interns, the one in the blue shirt. Her name is Sydney. Oh my gosh, isn't that crazy? Isn't that crazy? One in the red shirt, her name is Linda. And of course, you try to never miss an opportunity to go, Linda, Linda, listen, listen. <laughs> it's so dumb. But. Drew is here visiting and I started the live stream for some of the Patreon supporters and I start to say like, hey, what's up? How's everyone doing? Uh, where's everyone from? And all that fun stuff. And then I see his name pop up. He's like, hey, Derek. And I'm like, Drew, you're here. You are, you're literally here and you're watching, you're watching the live stream. Which I thought was very... He is a cheeky fella. He's kind of a cheeky... Uh, citizen of the internet. Uh, meme memeish, Meme. Meme lord type person. Understands the internet culture. So, yes. Being cheeky and silly and ironic is definitely something that... Uh, you know, he is well aware of. So, I would say that's... That's, that's more of like a... You know, ironic, facetious, par for the course kind of thing. Which I got a chuckle out of. Oh, stink face. You're making a stink face. Look at your stinky face. You have a very good stink face. Mm, very good stink face. And it was great because I was out there doing live stream and I ran into Heidi and Jamie and Melissa, who Melissa's always, Melissa is out here visiting as well. Uh, and they were also filming things for CARE's Patreon. So CARE uh, has a Patreon account, which of course, if you want to find it, it can be found at carerescuetexas.com. 
and care social media. Um, they do a lot of uh, Q and A stuff with Heidi. So all of you Heidi fans, all of you, the all of you cult of Heidi people. If you want to see Heidi, you gotta you gotta cough up a couple of bucks. That's how that works. If you're good at something, don't do it for free. <laughs> but uh, yeah, no, she's doing a lot of cute, and they call them affectionately enough, cute and a's, <gasps> cute and a's. Oh my gosh. But you can get insight from the woman herself. The queen of care. The, the mom. The mom of care. The, 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 and it's not just like to say like, oh, this is mama's house. It's not like that. No, almost like she is like a mother spirit. She's like the Gaia of care. That's Heidi. That's Heidi. I see. Oh my gosh. I see. I see some of the reactions. And don't get me wrong. Like, you know, people are like, oh my gosh, there's the silly funny guy. Like, hey, let's get a selfie, silly funny guy. When people either interact with me, come across me, like, oh my god, it's there. But then there's other people who see Heidi and they're like, you mean so much to me. You mean so much to me. And it's like not, I'm not being, I'm not making fun of that. I think it's a fantastic thing. I think it's an amazing thing. I'm just trying to give you a, you know, I'm trying to paint a picture. I'm trying to paint a picture. <gasps> Hi, Kiara. Hi, Kiara. I got to put my... She was, she was kind of barking at me a little bit earlier, and I wonder if it was having anything to do with my hat glasses combo. She seems to be doing a bit better now. Oh, my God. Look at her. Look at her. Look at her. Look at guys. Oh. I am smitten. I am a smitten kitten. Smitten like a mitten. I've been bitten by the smitten bug. Trying to be fitting into my smitten mitten. Trying to rhyme smitten requires a lot of wit witten. Okay, we're done, obviously. Yeah, at that point, we're done. <laughs> See, that's the thing. Don't get greedy. Don't get greedy. No, these are. That's a that black feather I found here at the compound. It might be like a like a turkey vulture kind of thing. And then these are turkey feathers um, from turkey that my mom shot. She goes turkey hunting. She loves some of that turkey hunting. And of course, deer hunting and small game. She'll do all sorts of different types of hunting, but uh, sitting in the sitting in the like the woods of Wisconsin wow at like five in the morning in November oh my gosh in a in a in a turkey blind that's just that is just heaven for my mom which is nuts <laughs> oh, look at this guy look at this guy he was getting into an argument with his ball earlier during the uh, during the live stream was he talking smack to you again? Was that ball talking smack? Why was that ball talking smack to you? Why was that ball saying mean things about you and your character? Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh no. We've been spotted. We have to try to sneak our way out of here. Don't make sudden movements. Don't make eye contact. And we may have a chance. We may make it out alive. Oh, oh, oh geez. Oh, gosh. I tripped. Oh, gosh. He's, oh, I'm, and I'm dead. <laughs> and I'm dead. 
I'm so dead. I'm so dead. Ooh. I am so dead. The deadest. You're real good at deadifying stuff. Oh, so, oh my goodness, look at this. Oh, jeepers. Oh, jeepers. This is my feet. Do you like it? If you don't like it, well, I can, I got a place where you can go. Right up my butt. Yep. Let me just move my tail over. That's where you can go. Beautiful out right now. Beautiful. It's relatively dry. The wind has finally calmed down. The sun lower in the sky, so it's certainly not as oppressive as it was earlier in the day. But even, you know, it wasn't terribly too bad today. It wasn't awful. It wasn't just disgusting. See, I moved a little bit lower because what I wanted to do was get a better frame. I wanted to get a better frame so that when your eye looks up at fire who is you know up there it's like you're seeing her against a set against a blue background there's no fence in the back but also i'm trying to uh i keep the grid lines on on my phone so i'm keeping her lined up with the apex of the top left grid line quadrant. Yes. Yes. Oh my gosh. Someone's belly aching. Someone's just making noise for the sake of making noise. Old complainy pants, tigers. I tell you, these dang old millennial tigers, they, just, they don't know how to work a day and working and stuff. Get a job. Contribute to the economy, you bums. But yeah, this definitely am happy that I was able to have the opportunity, take the time uh, to do some filming on Saturday evening. Oftentimes, because this is, you have to realize, huh, P, thank you, typical Tiggy. Hmm, typical Tiggy. Just, just when I thought that maybe I was gonna start actually thinking that you weren't so dumb. But I come home on the weekends and travel day is, you know, Friday evening and Sunday evening. So that usually only leaves Saturday evening. It's like, if, hey, if we want to go out to dinner, we want to go to a movie, we want to do something as a family or just me and Heidi, husband and wife, doing things that usually it typically falls on a Saturday. So we'll kind of do stuff like that. Family things that normal people do. On Saturdays. And that's why a lot of times I just don't have the opportunity to film on Saturday. So I ain't here. <laughs> Usually over in like Fort Worth, Dallas. Whoa. Jump, 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 jump. <gasps> Did you want to eat those girls? Uh, oh my gosh. What do they got? Is it? Do they have things for you? Do they have things for you? Do they have treats? <laughs> I mean, bleh. Slade seems to think that's for him. Slade says, Slade said that all of that chicken is actually for him. Even if it's not, it's still for him. Oh my gosh. 
Who's that chicken for? Oh, my oh does he actually get some? Yeah. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! He gets a whole bag! Oh my gosh, he gets a whole bag! Oh! Duh. It's, oh my gosh. Oh baby! That's some good stuff. Nice. Did you just. <laughs> that is. That. Linda. Linda, that is not where the chicken is supposed to go. I, uh, no, 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 that, that way. Oh my gosh. There we go. Yes, you are welcome. You are welcome. So, Linda, where are you from? Philadelphia. Linda's from Philadelphia. Where'd you go to school? Temple University. She went to Temple University. What did you study? Biology. She's, she's still in school. She studied by. Allergy. What sort of uh, job, what sort of career are you looking to have? Um, I want to be a vet. You want to be a vet? Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Okay. How much more of that there uh, schooling do you have to do over at Temple? Just one uh, more semester. One more semester. And then are you going to be doing the uh, the graduate program at Temple or are you going to be looking elsewhere? Um, I'm going to take a gap semester. A gap semester. Oh, I like Old Navy semesters. <laughs> I'm so funny. I'm so funny. <laughs> well, that's cool. Well, thanks a lot for uh, taking part of the uh, of the old cast. Uh, do you have any uh, Do you have any social media platforms that uh, you know you you share stuff on that you want to like shout out? We can, or do you keep yours just kind of like? That's fine. Nah, 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 that's okay. I mean, it's, you do you. You do you. It's all good. I always like to extend the, extend the shout-out. That's always. One of the perks of being an intern. Uh, yeah. As he says that, uh, that chicken is also for him. Yeah, we got a good group of interns. Good group of interns. Really happy and pleased with how they have learned and progressed and how much uh, care and professionalism they, they exude and exert. They've done a, a really tremendous job. Oh, Malita, Malita, Popita, hi, hi, say goodbye. Oh my gosh, she says all of the chickens belong to Malita. All of the chickens, please don't be crazy, please don't be crazy, please don't be crazy, please don't be crazy. Hi, hi, hello, hello, yes, yes. Oh my goodness. All right. Well, I think that we did a pretty decent job of casting. I know, you're not going to get me right now. It's in between. Okay, some people are like, why do some cats get chicken and other cats don't get chicken? This is an injustice. This is an outrage. It's an outrage. <laughs> no, it's because some cats are going to get, uh, you know, supplementary feed on in-between day. Oh, look, 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 look. Oh, red ants. Red ants. Red ants are neat. I like red ants. Um, because they're non, not so much intrusive and they don't, they kind of keep to themselves. It, they're different. People look at these guys and they think like, eh, it's fire ants. No, no, they're not fire ants. They're red ants. They're, they're bigger than fire ants. Their bite individually hurts a lot more than fire ants, but they tend to not bite. They tend to just kind of do their own thing. They just want to be left alone. Fire ants, on the other hand, I mean, you look at them the wrong way and they're just like, what? You want, you want, you want some of this? Let's go, bro. So, yeah. That's why they often die <laughs> out here. Oh, my gosh. Just can't have them. Oh, they're just, this is mean. Just mean. All right. All right.
Yep, no cats on this side. No cats on this side. Well, very good. Thank you so much for watching this episode of the Walk Around the Compound webcast. Hashtag Dorbus Award in the comment section below. Like and subscribe. Smash that like button. Hit that bell notification so you can get all your big cat goodness. Everything, you know, like Max YouTube. Woo! <laughs> and uh, if you want to learn more about this facility, of course, you can always visit the website carerescuetexas.com for more information. And I'll see you later. All right. Bye-bye.